Today, what was on my mind today is what I've been seeing going up and down Google. Uh, it's on Twitter. It's on YouTube. It's on basically, you know, everybody's just looking uh, at this. It's, it's about Little Wayne being hospitalized in Chicago for seizures. Now, what made me talk about this was because like a lot of negative things about this was um, up and down my timeline that he um, was dead. So. When I seen that headline, of course, it made me click. So it might have been like a, well, it was a clickbait because it got me to click on it right away. But then I'm not going to mention any names of who it was because that's not the kind of person I am to sit here and say, you know, whatever. I just don't do that. But um, the person that's on my timeline on YouTube um, disabled their comments because I guess they knew they didn't want the, the, the audience to come back with negative feedback. But whatever you put out there, of course, you're going to get the negative feedback in your comments. So I believe that's why the, um, the person kind of um, didn't want to show her chat. So because at first I was going to say something like, he's not dead. That's not what's in the news. He just had a, a seizure and that um, happened in Chicago. It's in, he's in the hospital in Chicago and that he's not dead. So it's like, why, why stare up something negative and then you didn't want the feedback? because you disabled your comments. So that tells me a lot about you, you know? So if you just wanted to get people to click on your channel, your video, and, and then when you read the end of what she's t uh, telling you, it's like, oh, he's, he's dead. And then you didn't say anything in your video. You just kind of put up some little headlines or something like that. But each thing that you were putting up was negative. So, you know, and your heading was like, you know, confirmed dead. So I'm like, oh shoot. So I clicked on it and I hurried up and went to Google and I'm like, let me see that. And that's not what I'm reading. I'm reading that he had another seizure in Chicago at a, at a Vegas gig, you know, and it, it made me really click on it. So, you know, clickbaits are real and it got me in there. And now I just want to talk about that. Like that's just, it's crazy. And he's, he suffered, um, numerous, well, multiple seizures in the past. So that's why I hurried up and clicked on it because, like, we all know that he's been through uh, a lot of um, a lot of these uh, seizures and things. So I was like, "Wow, is that maybe it's true?" Like, I just, and I hurried up and went down some timelines on Twitter, uh, Facebook, and Google, where it's trending at now. And I was like, "Wow!" And I went back to the girl's page. And I'm like, to see if she kind of let the disabled chat, you know, open up, and she didn't. So I'm like, "Wow, okay, great." You just did that to kind of get us to click on your video. But anyway, um, but if I was the kind of person to talk about somebody, I would, but I'm not, I'm not going to do that. Not right now. So, so I'm not going to do that. But uh, if you guys need more information on that, it's all over, it's all over uh, Twitter, TMZ, DJ Booth. I'm looking at it on my um, tablet. It's on the hip hop um, facts. It's, it's, it's all over the place. So if you haven't heard, take a look at that and know he's not dead. He just had a, another seizure. So those clickbaits are real, you guys. Just when you go in there, like if you're able to comment, comment and say, you know, you that's that's not the truth. <laughs> it's not the truth. But uh, that's all I wanted to talk about right now. Uh, but thank you guys for stopping by and check out my previous videos if you haven't already. And have a great day.